Yeah, well, I mean, one of the things that um, um, that we that we've got is a is is a whole program. It's called Broadband Consciousness that we run at our school from superheroes. And one of the very very powerful techniques that we uh, teach people is to uh, how to enjoy things before they happen. And, and of course, our script. And again, if you haven't heard about the script, hopefully you will have from some of our previous videos. But if not, check that one out. You know, the, the script is quite clear on this that you you can't enjoy something till it's already happened. Okay, to worry about it, we're we're fine on that. I mean, think about it. You know, um, if you ever woke up in the middle of the night where you just can't sleep, you, you, you just because you're so excited about what might happen in your future. Well, for most people, they've never done that. But the other way around, you see, the default setting is, look, it's fine to worry about anything before it happens. I mean, have you ever done that? Have you ever worried about anything before it happened? Perhaps a job interview or meeting somebody or worrying about you might not have enough money when you're older and how long you're going to live or what. In other words, we are already experts at experiencing our future before they happen. But normally, only with our fears. Would you choose that? If you were rewriting that script today that we work from, the script that says, well, no, you can worry about something before it happens, but you can't enjoy it. No way you do that. You do it the other way around. In other words, you already have the capability, the capacity within you now to experience things before they happen. All you do is flip it over. So instead of worrying about things, you can enjoy them. Let me ask you a question. Do you think if you're enjoying something before it happens, it's likely to affect the physical, material outcome of that event is rain wet. Of course it will. It's a no-baller. We know that. We know if we worry about things, really worry about them, it affects us. You can worry about something that's going to happen in a, in a year's time. And if you worry about it enough, it will bring your energy down now. It'll make you feel ill now. It'll stop you sleeping now. It will affect you at all levels now. By the same token, if you enjoy something now... It will affect you now. We've all done it where we've looked forward to something and it didn't happen, but we'd already enjoyed it. You know, I, I, I did a TV show in the UK that was really, really successful. And the makers of the program approached me and said, how do you feel about your own TV series, Richard? Now, the guy that had met me could see that I was getting too excited for him. And he said to me, uh, well, listen, Richard, you know, we're just a production company and, um, you know, that um, we're happy to make a pilot program, but then we've got to sell it to the networks. So it might not happen. So don't get too excited yet. I said, do you mind if I do? That was four years ago. The program hasn't happened yet, but I'm still enjoying it. The secret to being what we class as a superhero, and remember again, we're all superheroes pretending to be ordinary people. There's a superhero in there. There is inside everybody, but it's buried under so many pages of the script. A superhero doesn't wait for things to happen. They enjoy things before they happen and affect the outcome. That's a superhero. Remember, if you can worry about it, you can enjoy it. I suggest you try the latter.